Victor and Tabitha said they're uh, everywhere down there. Yeah, Jade went down there, clearly saw some disturbing shit. What he didn't see, creatures, the single one. Do you still think they're down there? I don't know. Maybe they went somewhere else after Tabitha and Victor found them. Or maybe they went deeper in. It's the one thing I do know. This is how they want us. Angry, stumbling around in the dark. I also know this. Hey, if we find them, there's a good chance we are not coming back. But if this is what you want to do, I will go with you side by side and we will take out as many of those motherfuckers as we can. I can't stop thinking about how scared she must have been, how alone she must have felt. Hey. She wasn't alone. What? They made me watch. I couldn't help her. I couldn't. Hey, they made me watch. They made me watch. <laughs> I couldn't help her. I couldn't. <laughs> but, hey, she was strong, Kenny. She was strong. Listen, listen to me. She was brave. She looked at me, and she did not take her eyes off me. And before... Before she died, she said, Oho Chuguko Yiga Takochi Gela. No, I, I don't even know if I'm saying this right. <laughs> Take care of him. That's what it means. Take care of him. He'll be alone now. Hey, 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 hey. Come here, come here, man. It's okay. I got you, bro. Hey, let's go back, okay? Let's go back. Let's go back. First day. See, me and Miranda were hippies uh, back in the day, but we gave up all the drugs, all the drinking when she got pregnant with Victor. Then one day, uh, years later, it was my 35th birthday, uh, Miranda gets it in her head that we're going to take a stroll down memory lane. She gets us two hits of acid. We take the kids to her parents' house for the night, and we take one last trip for old time's sake. That's when the voices started, when she started seeing things. She painted everything she saw. Oh, my God. She said it was like she'd been chosen. She said it was a place that was everywhere, but you couldn't find it if you tried. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Somewhere you could stumble into from anywhere, but never find a way to leave. She said there were people there. People who were lost and afraid who found themselves living inside a nightmare that they couldn't escape fighting a battle they knew they couldn't win she said they were holding on to hope and when that hope was gone, they held on to each other. It all 
sounded like riddles, gibberish. She said that of all the people who would find their way to this place, she was the one who had been chosen to free the children. But she wasn't the first. Others were chosen before her. She could see each and every one. And all of them had failed. None of them had ever set the children free. And none of them had ever gone home. So if you've seen the children, if they've called to you, then I guess you've been chosen now too. So how did you get out? I hold not. That, not good. Not good. Look, I know you uh, carry a lot of weight from this place, and I know I know it feels like like everything that happens. We can't keep doing this. We can't just keep sitting around waiting to see what. We need more information. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna need your help with something tomorrow. Okay? Y yeah. All right. But with what? We're gonna catch one of these fucking things. Are we still gonna live here? Even though Ten Ten's gone? I don't know. I have to take that one step at a time. Are you not coming inside? No, I'm gonna go check on the animals to make sure they're fed. It's almost dark. Won't be long. I'm gonna go too. Well, just be careful. Yeah, okay. I love you guys.